Hey everybody! So today we are going to play with a slightly different kind of foundation, still nice and quick. Um, and we are also going to play with a much bolder lip. Um, so if you know me, because I always follow this rule, or just a slight makeup rule, um, you know that typically when you are doing a bold lip, you want to kind of keep your eyes more neutral. So we're gonna stick to kind of the same thing we've been doing with the eyes, but we're gonna change up the foundation today and we're going to change up the lip. So if you guys are ready, I am ready. So let's get started. Per usual, we're gonna start with our beautiful face primer. I don't know, I always, I think it's because I start with my right, I put this product on my right hand, but I always start with my right cheek. I don't know why. Oh gosh, this stuff, it just spreads so well. I'm gonna put a little bit on my eyes. All right, so we've got that on. So per usual, I'm gonna go into my eyeliner. Nice and light. I really just like doing the waterline because it helps kind of like close that gap. If you have any gaps you feel like um, between your lashes at all, kind of helps fill that in and make them feel a little bit um, fuller. So nice and quick there. All right, so here's our new thing. We are gonna use our BB Flawless Cream today. Oh my gosh, this is gonna take me a second longer than normal because this is a new bottle, so it's not open yet. My bad, guys. All right. So I'm gonna just use my fingers to apply this today. So I'm gonna kind of do the same as I would for like a lotion. I'm gonna spread it on. The nice thing about your BB creams are that they are moisturizers. So you kinda hit two birds with one stone. You just wanna make sure that you really spread it nice and well. And you're still gonna wanna take it down your neck to blur those lines in. All right, so I've got my foundation on. We are going to move on. I'm gonna throw my mascara on really quick. So that stuff is so quick and simple, that BB cream. So nice. Just kinda put on a lotion, but also be getting a pretty good coverage. I think that um, I couldn't even label BB cream as a light coverage because I really I feel like it's more than that. If you ever do want your BB cream to be a little bit lighter coverage, the only, all you have to do is uh, just mix a little bit of your moisturizer in there and you can kind of dilute it a little bit too. It's also a nice way when you're kind of getting down to the bottom of your bottle to make it last a little bit longer. I knew. Look in my mirror. I knew I got some mascara on my eyelid. All right, so I'm going to, for our bold lip, I'm going to take Splash Liquid Lipstick. This is our new matte lipsticks. I'm so excited about this. This is stubborn. This is actually the very first time I've even tried this color, so I'm really excited. So instead of using this applicator, I'm actually gonna use the lip brush, um, and I'm going to just put a little bit of the product on my brush. I feel like with a lip brush you get a much smoother line. Oh, this is so pretty. These are very, very pigmented um, lipsticks. And they last for so long, so I love it. It's like double whammy. 
It does take like a second to dry, so you don't wanna put it on and instantly be eating or drinking anything. But there you go. Another five minute look. You got a little bit bolder lip. You got some great coverage from your um, BB cream and you're good to go guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed this one a little bit different. I know I even had my hair back today. Um, and I hope you guys are rocking out five minute makeup class. I will talk to you guys soon. Bye everybody.